When I began to write, I didn't know each of my words would bit by bit remove things from the world and in return leave blank spaces. That poems would begin to take the place of my own homeland, mother, father, first love, and second youth. And what I write would fade from this world, trade its solid being for unstable existence, turn to air, wind, tremors, fire. And what my poems touch on would freeze in life and crumble into small particles, nearly turn to antimatter, completely invisible dust, spinning in the air a long time until finally falling into your eye, making it start to water.